How does a woman have five kids? How oh, extra different men? How did you get there? How many kids? I have one. How many brothers? One. <laughs> hmm? I'm dead sure. And I am your girl, Kelly Shanta McGregor. We are all the way in Kimberley CBD, continuing with our quest of trying to find out what the people here know about the human body. Now, we all know that a few bags are up for grabs. Question is, are you going to be able to win some? There's only one way to find out without wasting any more of your time. Let's go. And next to me, we have this cute gentleman. Please give us your name. Uh, my name is Nentlantla. Lian. Anthony. Ponte, can I can you? Alrighty, in case you don't know, this is Toho. She's one of my colleagues and she said she wants some of this. The rule is, I asked you three questions. Huh? You get all three of them correct, I get to give you a few bucks. I get to give you 30 bucks. Nah? Or do you want it to be 40? You can make it 60. <laughs> <laughs> but it's fine. Nope. It's okay. Bucks. Yo, baby, give me my money. What and where is the vertebral column? Vertebral column. Is it not in the spine? Vertebral column. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's in the spine somewhere or in the optic nerve. I'm not sure. What is cumi lonimbus? I don't know. What is a vertebral culum? <laughs> what? <laughs> a vertebral culum? I don't know. Come on, try. All right, next question is, please tell us what a vertebral culum is. Vertebral culum? Yeah, I really don't know. <laughs> you can try. Vertebral culum. Do you want to try spelling? Vertebral. Uh -uh. Yeah, third question, spell it. Third question, spell it. Vertebral culum. V A T A B R A L culum. K U L U M. So I'm going to give you a riddle, and the riddle says I can fly, but I have no wings. I can cry, but I have no eyes. Wherever I go, Darkness follows me. What am I? I am a demon. <laughs> <laughs> what is the smallest organ on a human body? <laughs> think, think, think. It's all right, yeah. <laughs> wow. Are we pausing? Uh, I'm not sure, but is it not the gallbladder? No, no, it's not. Okay. All right, off to the next one. Uh, please tell us where a fallopian tube is. Yo, I wouldn't lie about that one, but I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> All right, one last question is, I'll make it an easy one for you. Yes. If Y E S spells yes, what does E Y E S spell? E Y E. Yes. E Y E S. Yo yo yo. <laughs> <laughs> e Y E S. Os. It almost sounds like E P W P, but okay. <laughs> e Y E. <laughs> e Y E. I really don't know. Should I pause? Pause, please. But I want the money. <laughs> I want the if Y E S spells yes, what does E Y E S spell? Eyes. She got a turret. She got a turret. She got a turret. <laughs> okay, he's not sure, so that is incorrect. Uh, third question being, I'm gonna need you to spell a word for me. <laughs> okay, please spell the word diaphragm for me. D I A P H D 
Daya D I A P H Daya R A R I A M Daya from If I'm not mistaken Close but no cigar that was also incorrect so it means Shame <laughs> But thank you for your time. Thank you for your time. <laughs> Spell the word xanthosis. 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 E N T. Start over. Z E N T. I O U S. Also incorrect. Also incorrect. <laughs> but it was xanthosis. It sounds like that woman on spelling B. I don't know that one. Is that one there? Mm. Okay, one last one. Okay. From that woman mm. of the spelling bee. Mm -hmm. Spell the word presta digitation. Ooh, it's long. Presta digitation. Yes. Am I right? Yes. P uh -huh. R E uh -huh. N T yes. A G <laughs> Your name T S H E G O F A T S O. Come on, guys. So, <laughs> alrighty, <laughs> please spell your name A N T H O N Y. Please spell your name A N T H O N Y. Incorrect. You were supposed to spell your name. Get it. Your name. Oh, that's a bit tricky. Spell the word <laughs> Xanthosis. Thank you. <laughs> Xanthosis. Yeah. Xanthosis. Z E N T H O S I S. Xanthosis. It's not. Uh, I tried. But at least, at least this is something. What do you say? I tried. One more question. No. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Well, you got all four of them incorrect, but we can always try next time. Mm. Hopefully, there will be a next time. Thank you for your time. You we hope much. to see you again soon. What message do I have to give? Yeah, for Kimberly. Never stop trying. What is? Exactly what you just did now. Yeah, never stop trying. You stop, then there's no life to it. You have to fail to become something better. That's nice. Okay. Lovely. Thank you for your time, eh? There you have it, guys. And just like that, we've come to the end of our episode today. And as you saw for yourselves, it turns out not all of us are that good at spelling and not all of us know that much about the human body. Uh, if you have any questions, all comments you can comment down below would like to hear your input on this don't forget to like follow and subscribe to all our social media pages i am kelly shanta mcgregor this is on the spot signing out